Hey yo, it's Brian here. Well, you know what it is today. It's wild card weekend, NFL playoffs, an exciting time of the year. We're coming near the end of the season, so the team is looking to make it to the Super Bowl and win it all. Every single team that's involved, I believe, 14 teams, both seven in the AFC, seven in the NFC. 49ers, San Francisco 49ers, luckily for them, they get a week off. So they do not have to play this weekend. They get some extra time to rest. And of all the teams that need it, yeah, the 49ers really need it. a lot of injuries throughout near the end of the season and to be able to get this rest for a while now i think it's very beneficial but i hope they don't get too much rest to the point where they're rusty and they, they just come out flat next week but i think in this case for the 49ers they really needed it a lot of guys were hurt and it's very beneficial to them but yeah exciting day today we got some former 49er assistant coaches now head coaches they're going to be playing for the first time in their playoff lives well i shouldn't say I should say one of them. His name is D'Amico Ryan for the Houston Texans. Big fan of his. Still from last year in 2022. Led the Texans to the playoffs in his first year with C.J. Stroud, a rookie quarterback. That's just awesome right there. They're playing a very tough Cleveland Browns team. We did lose to them around week five this year in 2023. Hoping that D'Amico has some success against them. Everybody should be as healthy as possible for this matchup. And it's going to be in Houston. Nice to have the Houston crowd over there. And yeah, good luck to D'Amico. Hopefully... He has success there. It's going to be a tough Cleveland Browns defense led by Jim Schwartz. And Joe Flacco is pulling a miracle out of him, which is really good right there. So, yeah, tough team. But I think the Texans, they got it. I'm believing in them. So good luck to D'Amico and the Houston Texans today. Other game tonight on NBC Peacock or Peacock only, the Chiefs and the Dolphins. Mike McDaniel, our man, offensive guy a, a few years ago now. He's in a very cold Kansas City day. I don't know if I give him as much of a chance uh, as I do D'Amico because, I don't know, they had some missed opportunities to, to have a home game in Miami, but instead they're going to a very frigid cold Kansas City night, I should say. I, I checked the temperature. It's about like negative 5 degrees as the whole statistics, but wind chill around negative 30. That is just insane right there. Wow. I mean, I'm ho hoping the best of luck to Miami because it's usually not that cold over there. Kansas City, I think they're pretty used to that kind of weather. They played in this kind of environment before Patrick Mahomes and all those guys. So I think they had the advantage there, but you never know. I, I think that they can make something happen for the Dolphins, but yeah, it's going to be a big challenge for them. And I'm hoping they're, that they're ready for it. I'm assuming our old guy, Raheem Mostert, is going to be the lead back for the day. And Actiné, I think that's his name. I believe those two guys are going to be getting a lot of touches in this one. I wouldn't be throwing the ball as much if I'm Tua. But, hey, I mean, if you got to get the ball down the field, you got to get the ball down the field, right? So good luck to Mike McDaniel. Good luck to D'Amico Ryans today. Hoping some great football action today. And we'll see if they move on to the next round. So, yeah, that's it for today. Tomorrow, we have the NFC wildcard for the most part. We do have one AFC game, Pittsburgh and Buffalo, tomorrow, 1 o'clock p.m. And then we have the big Cowboys, Packers. Also, the Rams and Lions, those are some epic games right there. We'll be facing one of those teams next week. That's going to be interesting to see who we play. We're going to be watching most of the games, enjoying it, just having a good time watching football, and hoping the referees do not get in the way. <laughs> just after Detroit Lions, right? So, yep, that's it, guys. Good luck to everybody playing this one. Always looking for a good match. Always looking for a competitive football. And I think we'll get some good ones today and tomorrow as well. Also, Monday night, Baker Mayfield, Tampa Bay versus the Philadelphia Eagles, who just fell apart for the most part. Getting update now that A.J. Brown will be out for this game. So, yeah, a lot of turmoil in Philadelphia. We'll see if they can get the fix. A quick one on Monday, but I don't think so. It's going to be really tough. So we'll see then. Bye, guys. Love y'all. I hope you have a great rest of your day, rest of your night. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Enjoy the games. 49er Faithful, 49er Empire. And yeah, we'll get back to it on Monday, Tuesday, where we predict the game in the divisional round against some NFC team. Don't know who. Maybe the Rams. Maybe the Packers. We'll see. So yeah, good luck to everybody. And I'll see y'all then. Bye, guys.